Hello everyone, happy Monday. I am of course John from More Than Dice and welcome to Mediocre Mech Warrior Monday Night Edition. This is where I play some casual stompy robots just for fun with whoever shows up. And who has showed up first? But of course Legionnaires. Hey Legion. It's going man, it's going. So we got an event going on and then we'll tell them about the mechs we're playing. Uh, the current event, assuming you don't have any of the Platinum mechs, which uh, I do, but not on this account. You might see them if I get done with the regular event, but... I mean, the Blood Name Challenge is still going on, but I'm pretty sure we're all done with that if we bought it. And then we're at the Irby Challenge, which is literally just a win and then get some match score. And I am at about a quarter of the way through, about 24-13. I'm technically 24% of the way through. 24-13 match score, so did pretty well there, you know. Well on track to finish it well within the time, so that's all good. Uh, and then I am playing, since I've decided what I'm going to do now, is I'm just going to go by weight class and skill up mechs. Whatever mech is most skilled is going to get it. So right now it's this Night Geyer Prime. Uh, I had the whole Night Geyer pack. I've been taking my time on skilling them up. I've got three fully skilled and two left to go. Uh, so we're finishing this one up. Should be done tonight. And then we're going to go to uh, this one here that's inappropriately named Jumpy Ass. Because it used to be a Jumpy Blood Ass. But I don't... I mean, it builds okay, but I don't think it's good. So we'll see. So uh, Legion, what are you playing, actually? Um, I'm going to play the Siren tonight. Uh, the the Banshee. But I've, I've made a list of four mechs for each weight class, two, two uh, Inner Sphere, two Clan, that I also have in that list, similar to what you're doing. You but, know, that uh, that is what I had first done way back in the day, and I think that's when I really started to get better, because I was getting a lot of time in mech. Mm -hmm. So you're playing the Banshee Siren, but I'm going to say very certainly it doesn't look like this one. No. Um, I decided, like, let's try something different. I've got I've got money, I've got weapons. Let What felt right ac23 snubs and an mrm20 felt pretty right i mean i am absolutely not going to argue with you on that let's see here snubby snubs snub snub it says mediums whoopsie snubby snub and i'm sure you ditched the jump jets because they are super heavy i actually had forgotten that it came with jump jets <laughs> I, that's how long I've had this mech that I forgot the jump jet for an option. Yeah, and I went with a, a light 20, a 320 rather. Yeah. Uh, and also, structure is uh, endo. Yeah, yeah. I mean, so, even just like this with the nine tons to play with, 1.28 is spicy, but I mean, hell, you can easily just throw in something like, I don't know, 1.39, suddenly good. One more heat sink. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Wild Butt instead, we throw a little bit of that there AC-20 ammo in. Mm -hmm. I went with four tons. Admittedly, I've already put it to the two ammo nodes, so I might could back it back now. Yeah, I never go more than three. All I could. Yeah, I never go more than three tons just because uh, it's it's enough. Okay. I do two in tabletop, three in MWO. I'm just going max armor because I can. Just seeing what it looks like to show everyone. I'm pretty sure you could max armor. I'm pretty sure this is probably close to max armor. Uh, pretty close. Mine had uh, 72 in the legs. But everything else was maxed armor. I've got uh, two and a half tons of MRM ammo, so... Which is way too much. One of those. So you dropped the heat sink. You went with an extra ton, uh, 20. Let's put it there. Why not? It'll go first. And then you said two and a half. You, uh, you and a half, uh, yeah. Of MRM. Oh, I don't have enough. Uh, probably a little less armor somewhere, but... So I wouldn't... Two is... So... One ton is more than enough for an MRM 10. Like, I'll run... So you're looking at 17 shots out of one ton. So that is 34 shots. Even with the okay. cooldown, you're probably never going to get 34. I think a ton and a half is probably plenty. Okay. Let me just do a little more armor here real quick. Something so like that. Drop the half ton. And then you probably don't need all that <clears throat> there. But then you get a ton oh, and a half with only two spots. I don't know what you do. Probably... Oh, ton and a half. Easy peasy. AMS. Oh, I, 
God, I didn't even think about that. Because that way you can, I mean, people don't like AMS so much, but it just takes the edge off of the missiles sometimes. Sometimes that's all you need is just, you know. So regular AMS or laser AMS? Oh, regular. You're, you're not super spicy, but you're spicy enough. Right. So that's pretty solid. Hey, Captain Missy. Uh, I mean, the only are other insane, thing that... yes, and cheers to not being able to be sober. Cheers. Uh, the only other thing I could think of is if the AMS doesn't work with that ton and a half, could you put in one jump jet? Nope, two tons. I'm gonna try that's two tons. I would probably target computer one, then an extra half ton of AC twenty just in case. <coughs> or you can go down a half ton AC twenty and have a ton. I don't know, but it, it, it's it's in that tweak level now. Yeah. No, I, I like the concept of it. This is the hardest part about this mech, is the one energy here and then the three in the arm. Yeah, it, it really is. You, you kind of want to move at least one of them into that torso. Yeah, because you cause just in case. Cause otherwise, if you just have the MRM-20, you lose this torso, you are an MRM-20. Granted, you're a very mm -hmm. fast-firing MRM-20 because it's got a ton of cooldown. So everyone looks at the quirks here. It's got PPC velocity, heat generation... 10% missile... Actually, they lowered the missile cooldown. Oh, because they gave it 5% general. Then 10% velocity, and then they gave all the assaults to jump jet stuff, so it makes good. And 10% heat in general, so that's pretty solid. Yeah, I actually missed about the... the. I didn't even look at the quirks when I was building it, so now that I put the PPCs in, it's like, hmm, maybe it was a better idea than I originally thought. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know I had been playing around with uh, something like an AC-10 and, like, a heavy peep. And then, like, an MRM-40. Because back in the day, its big thing was the insane, or relatively insane, missile cooldown. Mm -hmm. oh, Originally, a... I thought about two uh, LB-10s, but it just... Standard engine means you be slow. That's not necessarily bad, yeah. but... <clears throat> I mean, you could do MRM-40, but... So the thing is, with this build, you've got... You need a little more ammo for the MRM. Three tons is probably plenty. Two is probably 20 for an AC-10. Boom. I'd probably drop the AMS for the slots. Mm -hmm. The hard thing here is getting the heat to the point you want it. You'd probably do that. You got tonnage. <laughs> Go up. And I'm just, just spitballing <laughs> stuff here real quick. Oh, yeah. And then probably for close in, throw myself some meds. Makes it hot, but if you don't fire them all the time. I mean, that's pretty solid right there. Oh. Bless you. Multiple times. Good lord, man. Yeah. So something like uh, that, I, it's not it's, like super cool, but I don't know. It's been this way all day. Ooh, I'm glad I've decided to double check. I have not put anything in consumables. Well, there you go. Get them in there. I mean, you could also double five it. Double UAC five now. That it, That's a thing. <clears throat> but so even something like... So this is sort of like what I was trying to do. I would all, I would generally just strip this arm and just do what I could with the rest of it. So you're looking at something like this. Right. The MRM is sort of like an add-on weapon. But that, that bit's solid. It's a tough mech to work with. I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah. I'm not playing that right now. We are going to play this boyo. We're still playing the Night Guyer. And let's hit it. Yeah, it I'm hoping it saved the uh, consumables. I'm gonna double check. Okay. I put them in there, and then it's like, I don't want to tell you if you got them in there. I'm like, why? Oh, yep, it saved it. Cool. It's not like somebody jumped in, too. Yes. Hey, Minnie. Oh, good. I'm glad I said something now. Yeah, let me get him log in, then we'll jump and get him in. We'll be like the three amigos. Yes. What you amigo in in? <laughs> I, there's multiple ways to take that. I don't even know which way to go with that one. <clears throat> I, I mean, like, if you want to go amigo, like, you know, uh, Lovecraft amigo, then you better go that way. Oh, no, no. no. I'm going with the Spanish amigo. That seems a lot better than the Lovecraftian amigo. <laughs> I mean, there's a whole lot more sanity saved. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, there we go. That crack. 
Yes, just for everyone who wasn't looking, this is two peeps and two UAC fives. I actually dropped a Targon computer for another ton of ammo because I kept getting really low on UAC five ammo. Um, I, I mean, it says 1.6, but this is the hottest 1.6 I've ever seen in my fucking life. It must Oof. be. A, oh, we're a little heavy. Uh, I'm turning down. Okay. It must be the night guy room because I mean. Always makes me feel like it's a hot thing. Technically, though, is it, does it still have the not affected by outside heat thing? I didn't look at the, that quirk still there. Let's take a look. Because that was its big thing for a while. They might have removed it. Mm. External heat transfer minus 100%. So it doesn't get any bonus for cold maps. But it also doesn't get any penalty for hot maps. What you have in that... Iron. Oh. <laughs> oh. So, uh, AC 20 with three snubs and an Amram uh, 20. I see. A little I bit. Mean... Not too bad, actually. Not too bad. Yeah. Uh, I mean, come, come like, uh, OG coming to do damage. Oh, yeah. Just, I just wish I could have made it faster, but without an XL. Uh, you could, but you'd have to make it more brawly. You lose a little bit of range because you could go down to like an SRM four with Artemis, mm -hmm. and uh, then you're basically saving three tons. That goes into the engine. You can easily get up to three twenty five, maybe three thirty. I it... contemplated putting in an LRM instead of the MRM, but I felt like the MRM was the better. Uh, so they've done enough with the MRM twenty that I don't just immediately say fucking take a. Uh, uh, LRM-15 instead, but the LRM-15, that's still like a hot fight for... Those two weapons are very well balanced against each other now. Like, yeah. you, I don't know which one. I usually go LRM-15 just because sometimes you need to stand off and fight. That was my thing. It's like, I'm going to give it a couple rounds to decide whether it stays the MRM or goes to LRM. Because also, it could be too hot when you're brawling with the uh, MRM in there. Kind of... The, uh, like... Uh, maybe it's a little warm. I don't know. We're, we'll definitely see. I mean, not, this is probably not the best map to give this first outing in, though. Nah, I mean, give you an idea. Oh, I just mean it's like, if it feels good here, but will it feel as good on a hotter map? Well, you're more likely to brawl here, so we'll see. Well, ball ball I ended right up point. putting a UAC-20, two light peeps, and four ER mediums on my bounty hunter, too. Oh, wow. That's... Two... That's you have a slot left still. Uh, I have <laughs> three energy hard points open still. One in the head and one in each arm. Wait, no, never mind. Just one in the head. Gotcha. I forgot about the feet. <coughs> gotcha. Yeah, I did uh, LB twenty, which is my favorite build of that. You have to go with a standard engine, but with a laser in the head. Fuck it. Oh, we got Slam Arbo. It's over for them. Sly Marlboro kill him all himself, shit. Right? Sly he is Marlboro. a Bravo. I mean, Sly Marlboro is a real deal. And I mean, even worse, we have a War Buddha. I mean, that's a very weird thought. I know, right? We got some weight in this. Because you got Direwolf, Fafnir, and a... Uh... Uh, Annie? Online. All systems nominal. Override engage. Override if you gotta. Or even if you wanna. And like, on one level, I feel like I wanna cover the tunnel. But on another level, it's like, no, I don't. Well, uh, just be where we can be aware of it more than anything. Because there are two assaults over there, so we shouldn't go running off. I'm going to cover the uh, the saddle right now. All right, you guys are up. I'm going to head that way by via cover. And he's right behind you, too. Target spotted. There's 
one over the saddle. I saw the shot, but I didn't get the read. Yep. Target spotted. Careful pushing. You're it's just oh, never mind. Annie's coming too, other side, so you guys get a line. Let's push it a little bit. Target spotted. We're pushing a little bit, guys. Let's push in. Let's share it. Crabs up in CT. One shot. Sorry. Oh. Well, I ran into a. They're not pushing as much as I'd like. I'm eating a lot of damage. I heard you say push, so I, I pushed. Well, you were the guys pushing, that's why I said everyone else to, but. I tried pushing with you. Yeah, I mean, like, I thought that Annie was behind us, and I guess he backed off. He was not behind you, he was off to the side. Oh, uh, okay. Wow, they just popped over and popped my torso. Ultra auto cannon ammo destroyed. Left yeah, I mean that's pretty much destroyed. where mine I just like Ultra torso pop. Destroyed. I'm gonna be hot. We need to kill that Kodiak. He's on the saddle. You got him shot. Focus him. New target acquired. Heat level critical. Oh, don't fire all of it once, dog. Fuck, dude. New target acquired. You do not need a enhanced zoom right there. There you go, Charlie. Fuck Charlie. Destroyed. I see the one you faced. I think it's a uh, Highlander. I think it's got uh, flamers in it. It's actually not a bad idea on a mech that's uh, L big. An LB-20 in it, too. That's what got me. He outbrawled me. Oh, he's got two LB-20s. That's me. Yeah, he just... Yeah, it's yeah, like, the keeper. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, the keepers. That's a good mech. 12B20s is a way of life in that thing. I think our team's just not too timid. Not even that. It's just I feel like there's a little bit of a skill disparity. Because these guys are playing better and playing, I think, better builds than a lot of them, but, uh, yeah. <coughs> like this, this Fafnir, that's a terrible build. You can put that on a mech that's much better for it. I mean, like, the Hunchback had two ER larges and an LB, uh, LB-10. Weird. Yeah, not even good game in that one. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah, night gear's pretty good, but it can't hold the line like was needed in that. Should have realized what that Kodiak build was and ejected. I don't know what I'm taking. Cooldown, velocity, how sensors look. Let us go and get some more velocity, because velocity is never bad.
All right. Let's keep this open here. Oh, good. They delayed that Texas woman's uh, execution. Well, that's some hardcore, stupid-ass bullshit there. I mean, Elon bought Twitter, so I mean, there's that too. Yeah, it doesn't matter as much as people think. Because he can't just go banning people from doing things or people are just going to leave. We live before Twitter, we'll live after Twitter. Oh, I'm, I'm all for that. I'm just expecting uh, Jack Astry to return to it. No, I don't think so. He's... He's both better and worse than everyone thinks. He's better than, you know, those guys who really hate him. He's he's better than they think he is. But he's worse than the guys who love him think he is. Right. I mean, he's just an... Mostly crazy guy with money. He has good ideas, and he does some crazy shit that he thinks okay. I mean, like, I could do crazy shit if they gave me money. I just think if they gave me money, I wouldn't do that crazy shit, because I know some of that shit's not okay. Well, I didn't say I, I, it would be that kind of crazy shit. I'd just say I could do some crazy shit with some money. Like, I'm just off, curious what his game is. There are much better things to spend that much money on. Oh, yeah. But, I mean, like, spe speaking of game, first off, there was a promise of a taco truck on every corner. Ha! That promise needs to come back. I mean, they're going to have to tear down that wall. Taco trucks, man. That deregulation. Oh, is Frozen City going to hold on versus the Canyon Network? Looking like no. <clears throat> is it no? Nope. No Canyon. <coughs> man, I'm sorry about all the coughing folks. Sorry, man. It's uh, is what it is. It's real life here. We're not some allergies have been uh, some hmm. polished, uh, you know, stream of people who are all professionals. I'm a professional, but definitely not at playing this game. And it goes silent. There we go. <laughs> yeah, Captain Z, not so much a Twitch pro there. Not, not so much. Sorry, I'd stop for a minute to look at... Uh, I'd bought some uh, new Star Wars Legion models. Oh, cool. So, I'm curious what your next bombshell is going to be, uh, Legion. What are you going to ask about that's going to come true this week? Oh... Next bombshell. I mean, because you're like, hey, John, have you heard about anything new on another Kickstarter for Battletech? I'm like, nah, they haven't done that yet. And then they're like, boom, announcement. I'm like, well, shit. Oh, Hold on. Got it. I don't know. What? Uh-oh. have to think about it for a minute. So, Sir Arminius is on the other side. Reactor oh. online. He's a good dude. He's a good dude. Weapons just means that this one's getting streamed from both sides. Which sounds terrible, but I'm staying with that statement. I swear the circulation pen in the cockpit is a little uh, unnerving. The what in the cockpit? Uh, the Huntsman's uh, 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 cockpit with the circulating pen. Right oh. in between the uh, feet. Is there reason they call it a cockpit? Uh, I see what Old you did there. <laughs> so it's like still being in grade three. <laughs> I mean, you giggled in your mind. You can't lie. That's why I'm not in grade three. I was holding <laughs> in my mind. I don't understand what they're talking about. Grade three. Okay. Okay. I'm in grade seven. Cockpit. I mean. Yeah. Tee -hee, That's tee -hee. a pretty good achievement to be there. New target acquired. Help, they're shooting at me. The question is how many years have you been in that grade? Ah, uh, well. <laughs> that's the oh, achievement. Actually, 
I'm from Alberta, so I need grade 12, but we only repeat grade 12. New target acquired. I mean, you have the advantage. In America, they don't make anyone repeat. They just send the stupid kids ahead with the rest Spicy. of the class. Oh, well, that's yeah. what they do here, too, but it's basically, you sit ahead, you consider it not good, but... It's just harmful to everybody. Let me E4, huh? Yeah, Echo Let 4 low ground, many. New target acquired. If you're Brawly, that's your shit, but just be careful because there's many. Who's that many for? Everybody that might be on the other side. There's a very large problem for if somebody has an artillery or Oh, come on, I call the freaking rock. There's red cloak down in there somewhere. I need to consider the hotel coming around. He's open. Good kill, guys. Nice double kill there, boys. Some people call it long blade. I call it a sling blade. Mm -hmm. All right, there's ultra pushing here. Yeah, I'm coming. I need to earn some cash. That's right. Is that white down? They're still clutched up. If you got uh, Artie. Delta two. Um, Brennan, how do you say that? Route, route to Delta two. Brennan. I'm down. Sorry. Watch Fox drop pushing you guys. There is a mad cat. The F4 is a mad cat. Uh, got some missiles on him and a couple of blues. Marauder uh, facing la left. Sending left from the forehand. Side torso is open. Ooh, finish that Marauder. I'm on my way. If you got some damn on he's on Holy shit, how is he alive? Roger, nice. I would have blasted his legs off from him. Damn it. Coming around Fox 4. Yeah, there's a few. If that Warhammer is open, CT. Just that miss links up high, Echo uh, 3. Guys, uh, split up and check both sides of the car for uh, to go after him. Marked. Still Echo 3 moving away. Right echo, three, echo 3, Echo 3. And the Delta need, 3. Guys, you're going to need to try to cut him off because he's going to outrun all of us. <laughs> he liked me. He's going to outrun the crap out of me. I'm one third. I'm going over the top. Fast, Somebody's in the lead. This is said that. Take the high ground. Where the hell is he? He was uh, in last seen in Delta Three. You can be anywhere from Delta Four through Charlie Four. Sorry, Delta Two through Charlie Four. Target spotted. Mark. 
How about Charlie 3 instead? Just move around towards Delta 3. I'm swinging towards Charlie 4. It's Charlie 3 on the Charlie 2 side. Go to Charlie 4 up, and come in. Up, up high, Charlie 3, heading to Charlie 2. Circling back into Charlie 3 on the far side of the group. Keep it marked. Target spotted. Target destroyed. Nice. Good, Good job. job, everyone. I'll take it. <clears throat> yeah. Good coordination there. Yeah, that was a good game. Oh, wow. I mean, I guess that's a good game. Maybe, John. <laughs> I somehow got an up arrow. I mean, up arrows happen. Yeah, those born uh, guys helped out a lot. I didn't realize it did that much damage, I'll be honest. Yeah, that, that was a really good game, John. Only one kill, though, because... I mean, I swore I killed that uh, Nova Cat coming around because I popped him nope, square that, in the head with AC twenty. Nope, that was my kill. Sorry, I kind of, I was above him and I would just shot him when he was uh, he shut down. Yeah, and then and I, I shut down on my shot. And yeah, he was still shut down, but I ended him while you were shut down. That's why I was like, oh, that was my kill. Sorry. I got three KMDDs, and I think none of them are that one. Uh, well, that is going to be almost enough skill points to finish this mech. So what do we want? We want... No, no. Seismic. Seismic. And then velocity, velocity. And then... Cooldown seems really stupid because this mech's hot. What do we get with two, though? Oh, hold on, we know what we need. We need cool shot cooldown, and then we'll take the last <clears> one as a UAV or something. Alright, cool. We are ready for one more drop in this thing, and then we'll switch. Okay, just a second. Excuse me. Or not, is all your choice. What is this guy saying? I hate it when, like, the, the quiet ones suddenly are like, hey, we're doing this thing, like... You guys haven't posted, like, in months, and then suddenly, three times in one day, and you're fucking tagging us all? Three times in one day? Oh, you mean on Discord? Yeah. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm with you. I'm so thinking of making a Hobby Streak Discord, because for anyone who wants to eject from Twitter. I think that's a good idea. Speaking of hobby streak and stuff, I'm surprised we haven't seen anything from Burke recently. Uh, he tends to go in waves, I feel. There's my 3,000 match score. And getting close to 4. <clears throat> was there anything on this one um, on the website, or was it all just in the app? For what? For the uh, Urban Mech event. Uh, no, it's all in the app. Okay. Because <clears throat> it's just, there's no uh, loot bags or anything. I mean, honestly, an egg hunt would be cool if you could put little things on the board on the map that you could go get. Oh, but yeah, well, I mean... People would be doing that and not a... shooting, and then that people would be pissed. Yeah. But if you do bonuses, and you, like, you get them for whatever things, part of the game, and then you also get the bonus ones, that might be cool. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I just spitball in there. Oh, yeah. So, uh, going back to the, the the new Kickstarter coming out where they're focusing on merc mercenaries. And vehicles, uh, apparently. Hmm? And vehicles, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> I, I like that part. But I wonder if they're going to do infantry as well. Maybe. Um, I'm, I'm not going to lie, though. I'm glad it's in the latter half of the year. Yeah. So, uh, do you know why you got an up arrow empty? That last game? Or a mini? 
No, I don't. Uh, because two, three, four, five people on our team got lower match scores than you, and nine people on the enemy team got lower scores than you. You were in the top half of that match. Nice. <laughs> I was just shooting missiles. I mean, shooting missiles will do it. Uh, blah, 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 blah. What am I range? I could Frozen City. You can't really Frozen City. <coughs> Rubalite. Nope, Canyon. At least keep my multiplier. Right. I, I told one of my friends to see that movie, and she's like, well, that sounds like my kind of movie. And then she told her boyfriend, and he's like, you haven't seen that movie? I'm like, mm -hmm. <laughs> It's a classic. I mean, at this point, I kind of feel like you got to watch more uh, Bruce Willis movies. Mm, you got to pick and choose, though. He's got some stinkers as well. Well, I mean, that's true. I can absolutely say that his little cameo scene in The Expendables 1 was terrible. He was fine in 2. His, him being in G.I. Joe was just, he was, was not good. The second G.I. Joe movie, which I actually like. Mm -hmm. I actually don't hate either of them. The second one was a lot better, but he was just not good in it. Purple gnome feet. And... Alright, so I'm, I'm gonna... Predictions I've gotta make. Uh, I, don't, I, I feel like... We're set on, on Battletech for the year, so it's gotta be something else. Online. <laughs> Star Arminius again. Yep, I don't think he realizes who I am, though. Because I'm in my alt. I'm sure there's a ramp there, but I got the jumpy jets. Jumpy jets! Flying through the air with the greatest of ease. I, I, I'm like pinned between all these finger gun guys. <laughs> All right, I'm going to hold here for now. Though they're over two there. lights that basically jetted straight across. Yep. I'm going to try and get around to a point where I can support them better. But this hill is bigger than I thought it was. <clears throat> Target acquired. Target spotted. Target spotted. Acquired. I don't want to get too far ahead, but I want to get to a place where I can cover and help. Target spotted. Also, just in case, I'm getting ahead of the... New target. Target spotted. Holy shitballs. Target spotted. So rough. Left side of five. He's going wide. They're all coming up that uh, canyon. Target acquired. Target spotted. And apparently ECM doesn't mean a fucking thing. New target acquired. Because they're all shooting me. Target spotted. I'm already at 87% and I barely engaged. I don't want to have to push. New target acquired. Target spotted. All right, I'm gonna push forward a bit. I got it. New target acquired. Target target. Kilo on the left side. Don't fuck. Atlas. Play target acquired. Target spotted. New target. All these ER large target lasers. Spotted. Oh yeah. Kilo, kilo. Keep hitting him. New target acquired.
Borg metal, keep it. Target spotted. I can't keep peeking. Target spotted. New target. Way too good. Don't peek Delta 3, they got the sight in way too good. I'm the only one holding Delta 4. This is gonna go poorly. New target acquired. Oh yeah, this this was a mistake me trying to flank. Oh I see ya. Um Destroyed. You might come in, okay? New target acquired. God damn. They just came around and murdered me. We had no push. Yeah. It's not a bad idea. The problem is with the rest of the force disappearing, you guys are just going to be late to the party. Mm -hmm. Just get what you can. Those guys in the cannon should be softened up. I did a, a fair amount of damage to them. There you go, Legion. Oh, this Orion with you is in terrible shape. Yeah, stay down in the canyon. It's the better call. Yeah, they have too many, like, all front-loaded... Oh yeah, this guy's dead. Oh, well, at least I killed me. Yeah, no doubt. That was not... No. That's a Nasa. Awesome. <laughs> Nah. Let's see if it's enough to get me the last point so I can put this away for a little bit. It is. Awesome. So with, with the um, Kickstarter announcement, I feel like I've got to uh, make make a run to finish up buying up all the original boxes before the new stuff gets here. Nah, but I know what you mean. All right. So that boy is skilled up, so we're going to go to Assault now, and this Blood Asp is the one that's the most skilled, so... Well, just a second before you uh, worry about tonnage and stuff. So, because... I'm like, it's okay, but it's it's so hot, so I'm going to go something a whole lot lighter. Definitely not cooler, though. So here is what we're bringing. We're bringing a Blood Asp. Uh, I think we're actually going to do this. There we go. Boom. Two LB20s, two BPCs. Mm. Let me put some weapon groups real quick. Um, should be good. Oh, wow. <laughs> we, we went differing ways. You guys went down and I went up. Yep. Uh, Cookie, I'm just going through on <clears throat> whatever is the most skilled in weight class. 
and then I go to the next weight class. I also don't think I own a locust in this, so maybe when I get done all my lights. Spoiler, that'll be a while. Figure that way I'll get some work on them rather than jumping around like a crazy person. Because otherwise I'll ignore the lights and mediums for heavies and assaults. And I don't want to do that. I want to get a little more variety going. Alright, I figured out my prediction. Legion's cr magical crystal ball of bullshit. There's <laughs> 2023 Games Workshop comes out with Chaos Wars. Okay. That's that's a good one, actually. Uh, I mean... Actually, Cookie, there's some locusts that are really decidedly fucking scary. Like, I I have one word, like, literally, it just gets one laser weapon or some machine guns. I don't put machine guns on it. But it can actually get armor. <laughs> Apparently Streamlabs said we got a triple smiley face combo. I'm not sure what that means, but awesome. Triple smiley face combo. Yeah, apparently. I mean, like... What is that like a a number eleven at at the uh, the takeout window? Ooh, number eleven uh, at uh, Burger King. That is the fish, which is what I like. <laughs> Once again, Legion's magical prediction <laughs> ball of bullshit. <laughs> Fair. Oh yeah, Cookie. Really, I'll show you. Uh, remind me after this, and I will show you. Uh, it's I have it on my main, but uh, I'll show you the one that it is. It gets a bunch of armor buffs to make it. A viable mech, and then if you fill out the armor tree, mm. <clears throat> it is Weapons good. Online. All systems nominal. Override engage. Oh, it's not a fish burger. It's a fish fly. It's BK Big Fish is actually one of the better fish sandwiches out there. As a connoisseur of fish sandwiches. Okay. Damn it, empty. It's all my fault, I know. Man, I love the blood like ass. I ran away, and then, and then you turned around and hit my leg again. Is it bad that the blood <laughs> ass feels faster than the night guy? I don't think it is, but it actually feels faster. This time. It's a little spicy. Oh my god, you guys have a fucking light pack. As a assault, I need to figure out where we're going and head there. We have a disconnect. Bushy. He's in range, technically, if I can get line of sight. Target spotted. Target spotted. New target Oop. acquired. That's how it's getting scary, because there's a lot of guys over there in there. Yep. Target acquired. J9. J9. New target. Light Arrive. hotel aid into target India aid. Watch it, guys. New target. Oops, that's the wrong button. Look, I move. Good.
I mean, you're gonna show me your back, I'm gonna LB-20 you in the fucking back. Well, I mean, they're chasing me, so... I don't know who that guy was chasing, Target but... Acquired. You're doing your job, sir. You're doing the Lord's work. Target spotted. New target acquired. Well, they're all focusing on me. Whenever I peek, it's like, hey, shoot that fucker. God, they just fucking hide till like I'm out. It's funny. Spider legs. Alpha. I just can't do anything because they got me pinned because we're not getting enough push. Take that Echo, he's almost dead. Legs. Echo Centurion, legs. Jesus, how are you hitting me when I'm around the fucking corner? Bushy, open CT, get him. Bushwhacker down. Thank you. Uh, watch your flank though, each uh, side. I saw some guys kind of poking through. They might get cocky. Wow. Yep, target L, pushing through. He's a little beat up. Target destroyed. Left torso critical. Oh wow, we're not nearly as far ahead as I thought. I mean, we are pretty far ahead. I thought it was mopping up. Kill on Lima. Oh. Oh fuck. I have a problem. Out of blew, ammo? They blow off my armor out of ammo. Destroyed. Target acquired. Good job, everyone. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I shared. I have armor and a leg in my head. A solid damage mount, not great. I didn't make great shots, but. 
I will be extremely happy with that match score in a light. Oh yeah, that's a good. That's good stuff, dog. The hardest thing is I got to get used to the peeps on this thing because they don't have the mm -hmm. same velocity as the other ones, so they're <coughs> it's harder to lead. So, so I was going to show what? Cookie that locust. Go ahead. I was going to say the best part about that is I kept messing up. And I was only single firing half my weapons. Oh. I was like, oh wait, I have arm weapons. So. You. The 1V. This boyo. It doesn't seem like much. But. <coughs> he gets. 8 center horse armor, 8 left torso, 8 right torso, 8 left arm. Eight right arm and nine each leg. Gets ten percent range, fifty percent energy cooldown, and fifty percent machine gun rate of fire. So literally, the one I play tends to look something like. Uh, we go with a standard. We go with endo steel, full pharaoh, and I want to say we get up to that engine. Drop a heat sink. Um, what else do we do on this thing? Hmm. I must actually not. Oh, I know I did. I did a 150. Because. So, my standard build, I'll actually just do a large or an ER large in the CT standard engine heat's fine I don't care about arms in this version I literally just max out everything else and then put whatever's left in the arms just a little bit this is also an eminently cheap mech if someone's looking to get into lights boom that's 25, and that's pretty good. But the thing is, is when you actually add the skills to it, you're getting so much more out of it. Um, Do something silly? Let's do something silly. Sure, why not? Um, Yeah, whatever. It's not even expensive. So, just for shits and giggles right now. Boom. And also, I don't own a locust, so where to go? Did I not purchase it? There we go. Boom. Home. Select. There we go. So. Quite literally... If you don't put double heat sinks in it, because you don't need it. Sure, the engine's a little much, but you're still talking basically under a mil to make this mech. You can go ER large, you can do standard large, and uh, let's see where we go. Well, this went to 14, 13, and then we upped that maximum. But then, when you put the skills in here, and you just max out as much survival as you can, you don't need to get scaled to density, but at the point you're going all in on armor, and I know I just said going all in on armor and I'm talking about a fucking locust, but still. So, like, if you really got hard up on skill points, you could skip this stuff, but you might as well just fucking get this armor hardening here. Because you're getting 2.6% armor, armor per. So you do something like that. And then you look... 30? 31 in the legs? Okay. 35 CT? You can take a fucking heavy gauss to any part of this mech that's not an arm. It's crazy. For a mech this size... So, I mean, is it good? I, you know, sure, whatever. But it also doesn't overheat. 
and you've got 800 meter range on your weapon with a cooldown of two seconds, it just fires. And if you take the large laser instead, and this is, I'm not even optimally building that. You could put even a lighted in engine in there, get up heavier. You could even get to a 180, go 145, still are reasonably survivable. And this large laser, I mean, you're literally... It's got a 0.65 duration and a 1.75 time before skills. So you're fired every two and a half seconds at 500 meters. And you're never gaining heat. Technically, you're just not gonna... It can be. And also, if you want to be, like, stupid, I'm gonna <clears throat> murder people, you get the biggest engine you can... You put yourself, say, a medium pulse laser and <coughs> some standard machine guns, just because they're more caught, more weight efficient than anything else. Let's put a heat sink in the head. Boom. So you might need to do some tweak in there. Maybe just a medium, maybe a small pulse, just for range purposes. Boom, small pulse. Then you get yourself a ton and maybe a half of ammo, maybe. And your arms are still pretty armored. You can take a gauze. AC-20 doesn't blow your arm off. So, I mean... This thing is surprisingly tanky. And the way I was doing it with the 150 standard... Quite literally... The only parts of the mech I need then... Is this stuff. You lose this torso? Don't fucking care. You know? You lose the arms, you don't care. You ain't got nothing in them. Boom. Put the other heat sink back in. Like, it's not even expensive. I'm just going to save it. Why not? I'm not going to play it. It's, it's tiny, but it's like crazy armored by comparison. Um, Clan mech. What do you got? The flea. The flea here. The flea, this is all this was way more expensive to buy because everything. But it's got 17 in the torso, not 30. It is like a world of difference. Even armored down, my arms have more armor than this thing. It's crazy, I'm telling you. It is armored like a mech probably twice. Oh, not twice the size, but the Kit Fox here. The Kit Fox has more armor CT, a little more legs, and obviously the arms are more, but it's similar. And the Kitbox has got good armor quirks. And I put some skills into that. You look at this Javelin, 10 tons heavier, it's less leg armor, less torso armor, only the CT. It's crazy. Anyways, sorry. I ran in there. That's a fun locus to play. There's a lot of versatility <clears throat> in that. It's just... At a certain point, it gets a little pricey. But for that build right there, super fun. You just hide. You fire your large laser. Uh, love it. So, back to this boyo. Let me... Sorry, guys. Let me get some skills on this thing real quick. Or some more skills. Four. Uh, we're working on that, but... We need velocity. Velocity, velocity... We got all the heat gen, mag cap, definitely the magazine capacity, I think you guys would agree. So I ran out last game. There we go. Uh, let's hit it again. Oh, bye, Minnie. I didn't realize Minnie left. Yeah, uh, he just dipped like he always does. He is a mini ninja. A ninja, if you prefer. Yeah, so there's a lot you can look into when you look at mechs. And the Cauldron, who does all the balancing for PGI now, they're players. They go a long way to make each mech worth it. Like, oh, don't have a lot of hard points? Well, let's make what you have really worth it. 
Like, I think that small pulse laser machine gun one running around just... You have to get in close, but you can dish out damage. I prefer the longer range one. Or, how about silliness? We put a rack on that. Mm hmm Was it good? Mm hmm mm, Not so much. Was it amusing? Hells yes. And quite literally, I just sat behind a wall. I'd pop out and shoot, 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 shoot then hide. They'd rotate around. No one would come get me because they need their guys in the front line. Then I'd pop out. Get some arty strikes on it so you're behind them, dropping arty on them as they come around. Oh, I think I might have dropped. Nope. Uh, you know, there's... Oh, man, I'm kind of glad I'm into javelin now. There's a bunch of crazy tactics you can do. Light mechs just... People think light mechs are all fast, run around, get in their way, and, and be an ass. That's not always what it is. Every mech, you just got to know how to play it. Which is why you'll see as we play more games, it seems like we get better at certain mechs. I mean, the, ja the javelin that I've got definitely wants to hit and run. It oh, yeah. does not... Because it's also cool. super hot. You get a couple volleys and you're like, out! Well, also, it's... The armor's just so light. Like, I took one shot, I didn't even know I, I caught me. It's like, well, going? my arm's hey, almost gone. Hey. Well, like I said, it has less armor than that... My javelin has less armor than that oh, fully down. skilled out locust. That's yeah. silly. But funny. Very good day. Yeah, so far so good. I brought an arc, so I hope anybody with LRMs will enjoy. Yes, sir. <laughs> uh, except he's an R63. Did he... Oh, God. I hope he didn't bring... No, I don't think he even has that. I don't see anyone here who's really... Maybe the hell spawn. Mauler's always could. Shadowcat probably not. Stalker. Honestly, wish that there were different uh, missile pipes like uh, napalm and all that other stuff to overheat mechs. I want to see a hardwire missile type or a uh, haywire. Oh, yeah, that would be hilarious. Weapons online. The domination oh, conquest. Dude, Jester, I was just thinking that every game I've seen you in, you're in your LRM boat. Anyone going Theta? I'm going Theta. Please uh, give uh, me some missile support if I need it. Heading Theta now. I'll get up on the canyon and try and give you some direct fire support. Target acquired. Target spotted. Take that, Raven. Narc Jazz. Never mind, I'm heading to Epi because they got some guys there. We have data. Javelin, start going to the right. Target's gone. New target acquired. They stayed back heavy towards their base. You need help at Epi. Thank you guys. Light under that UAV. They have a ton of lights and fast mediums. I tried to put some damage on the shocker via the next, but that's the best I could do. Like as 
soon as they saw I was alive, there was a pack of What is hitting me? Oh. They got a light off stealth guy. Bravo for ish. New target acquired. Go poorly, we can't. They got too many guys to direct fire on us now. New target acquired. Damn it. I can't take six guys at once. But it had pretty good damage in that short time. <coughs> I mean, I think the one guy we killed was the DC. They, they had way more light mechs and were way better pilots. Well, those two guys who ran into Epi just ran in and just got over, outplayed. Oh, man. Rest in peace, guys. And you get a report for being, for being an ass? Yeah. yeah. Cookie, I get focused once in a while. I was a big mech, it happens. I don't have ECM. I don't have that hull. It's all good, though. Yeah, I had a feeling that's how it went. Yeah, that's one of those ones where Javelin, just... Nova, Piranha, Raven, Locust, yeah. Kit Fox, and looks like a Cicada. No, a Centurion. Yeah, they they just swarmed us. Oh yeah, they did a, they did a good job. <clears throat> no, no, I'm not fussing about them doing a good job. I'm just like we were able to swarm. Uh, that was th that was their game, not ours. Dummy sign decal, LRM five, Drunk Reader Mark seven, and an SRM two. With Artemis. Let me go sell something real quick. In case you're wondering, Cookie, I always sell SRM 2s and LRM 5s with Artemis because, in the SRM's case, the Artemis is as heavy as the fucking launcher, and you would just take an SRM 4 instead. And in the LRM's case, it's 50% of the weight, so you, there's better things to do.
trying to think what else I do with this. I mean, I got nine skill points. Not going to get me much there. Sensors? I guess always sensors, huh? Alright. Let's go when you're ready. Oh, sorry. No, you're fine. I did get to 4,000. I might hit 5,000 before then before we stop for the night. But in any case, 2,000 a night means I'll be done in five nights. So three more, which would be Sunday, Monday. Because I'm actually, unfortunately, going to have to miss a Sunday and a Monday for being out of town. Hmm. Because I do not have a laptop to play this from the hotel in uh, Nashville. And also, may not be off work at the time I'd normally play. It's prime meeting time. Everyone always jokes, oh, go have fun. I'm like, you realize we have meetings. Like, literally, I get off, I have an hour to maybe chill or something, and then I get in a meeting. Ugh. The Sundays are better because the Sunday generally it's I get there, I check out our area, make sure everything's good, and then they're like, just do what you want. And I get a little bit of time to do what I want. In uh, Vegas, unfortunately, my hotel room wasn't ready, so I couldn't do anything. But uh, Nashville was better last time, hopefully be better. I think more people are still living there. Vegas, a lot of people moved out because... There was, with service industry down during COVID, there was nothing to do, right? Mm-hmm. So I'll be honest, uh, Legion, I think almost all of my good Night Guyer bills have gotten me over a thousand damage. I mean, sounds like you understand how to play the chassis. Uh, we haven't played River City yet. Let's some River City. Did we play River? No. I watched the game Phil played on YouTube on River City, but I didn't actually play River City myself. Hmm. I like that he puts up games he loses, too. Even games where he gets teabagged. Which I'm not okay with. I would have totally reported I mean, like, that. I don't even understand how you teabag in this game. You stand over them, you power down, then you power up. Oh. Now you know. Yeah, I do. And I could see people doing that to Phil. Yeah, I don't know why, but... You're a big streamer, I got you. Okay, good job. We're playing the game, fuckhead. Because Phil is, like, in victory, usually one of the more gracious people. He apologized to me for so long when he fucking just zapped me off one match. I'm like, well, that's not good. Damn. Mr. Heavy Goose Man Guy with Gun. Okay. That's a name. Though Napoleon Blonaparte's much better. Angry Ninja. I always look at names and I'm like, where did they come up with that shit? Some of them you're like, ah, obvious. Some of them you're like, what is going on? Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Override engage. This is Clan Command. Get to the target and capture it. Cut down any enemy that get in the way. Oh, there we go. Just be careful over there. Don't get well, I just like I got caught all the things that could get in my way. Oh, well, that was awesome. What's that? Oh, I was trying to jump up high. It okay. won't let me jump to the second level. Because you're getting caught on a ledge. 
Yeah, but I had enough. Um, it, Target spotted. The ledge has an okay. overhang, so sometimes it just blocks you completely. Oh, I. We, we hate it. We think they should get rid of it, but. a little bit. We were going hard, but the assaults have sort of calmed down a little bit. Target acquired. Target acquired. Target acquired. You think I won't just shoot a sliver of your fucking mech, you crazy dog? How did that not hit him? It's bullshit. Seriously? Pushing golf seven hard. Oh fuck, now I'm stuck because of the stupid ledge here. Yep. Alright, now I'm good. me besides just you I mean you're doing your part no, but I need hotel hotels a problem for me I'm dead basically as soon as he pops around I'm gonna die my CT's open light behind me Golf six new target acquired nope. couldn't twist enough Passive teams, and we're losing. Like, I thought they were gonna push hard, but they just pushed hard for a couple seconds and decided, fuck it, too much. This piranha's almost leg, which is a problem, too. I think this guy's using a lag switch. I made one guy over, he'd kill himself. There you go. That counts for you. The uh, last remaining piranha is legged. Yeah. Like, this one guy that's standing here is like, is he just dead and propped up? Or... Oh, wow. That was... I mean, 712 is a, a solid game. It just didn't feel solid. No. I got an equals. 
Yeah, I got another down arrow. It, it's it's light make Mondays. Oh uh, uh, yeah, light makes it tough. I just think it's a solid job in that thing. Oh well, there there there's part of it. They had a a, a four man. Lance. Yeah. Yep. Two direwolves uh, fleeing a rifleman. Yeah, yeah the rifleman's what messed me up. It's like I was sitting there spotting for a while until I could find guys that were, and he's like, oh, I'm going to see you even though I don't see how he saw me. I mean, some of those guys are really good. Like, I, I look and sometimes I'm like, I can't see me, but you can probably see me outside of what I got, so. I'm going to drop mm -hmm. you as a leader so I can use the restroom real quick. Okay. One. I didn't vote for that shit. <laughs> That's a ton of Sterotherma. Yeah, well, I'm going to be spicy, <clears throat> but I'm playing things with peeps, so I expect it. Oh. <coughs> I can remember to tell everyone and send a uh, message out that Wednesday, I believe, I am going to be streaming me open my uh, second display case of salvage boxes. So... Should be fun. It was fun the first time. All right. So here's what's going to happen when I finally do that uh, challenge that Big Knight gave me, with just the grasshopper with the five year larges. You know, do this without overheating. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get this map all the time and be like, fuck! Yeah. Oh, one inch punch. He's the one who killed me last time. Reactor. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems. This is Clan Command. Get to the target and capture it. Cut down any enemy that get in the way. Oh, seriously? I'm trying to desperately push forward, and there's a disconnected flea direct or locust directly in front of me. Uh, I always just go forward and then turn to where to have a direction I want to go, just to get out of the jumble. <sighs> he's not even DC. He's actually just late to the party. I'm gonna leg him. I can both, leg him. I was about to say both of my legs are already right, jacked now. I mean, it's one point of damage. It's not a big deal. How often I get legged? Don't I mean, fair. But you're light. They're going to shoot your legs. What also means that I got late to the party up here. It's all right. You guys got there at the same time, which is funny. Just be careful. Target spotted. We're all pretty close behind you, though. Within sight in the grid square, so. Target spotted. Target spotted. Oh, son of a bitch. Of course, Target one guy comes acquired. up, and I take him. Of course, one guy's going to be aggressive.
Well, the only good thing about running uh, LBs on this particular thing is I fired that general direction and I tend to hit something. Target spotted. New target acquired. God, uh, we've got folks following me. Target spotted. Love it. You and me again, one inch punch. Target spotted. New target acquired. New target acquired. So much damage because we ain't got 91 else pushing. New target acquired. Target spotted. Warning. Center torso. Target spotted. Damage. Okay. All of his missiles hit my CT. Oh, seriously? You. Oh, look. Damn it. What? I'm so, so annoyed by this bullshit. Thanks. Rip. Okay. Lima. Lima. Uh, I can't die Lamo explosion. Oh, oh, leg. Oh. We're still doing good, dude. Just do your best. No, it, it's people directly running like our own. It's hectic, man. It ain't on purpose. There comes a point where it's like. Crabs open CT. Good kill. Thanks. Keep it up. New target acquired. Target spotted. There you go. Oh. That was a friendly hitting you a little Hi. bit. New target uh, acquired. At, th at this point, I'm expecting most all of my damage to be coming from friendlies. Yep. Yeah, but... New target oh. acquired. Target Focus that rack guy. Warhammer. Warhammer? Nah. No, it's right on the New target. On golf. Yep, right from CT's open. Left horses. Right horses open. Last one. Nope, got him. Good job. Warriors, the there you go, Legion. I saw you popping around. Look, you did a good job there. <clears throat> Just like I said, every time I turn around, I'm tripping over one of our own. Well, yeah, you I mean, guys. Like... You guys were up where it was dangerous as shit up in their up in their face. So. Oof! That battle master did not. I feel like I did pretty good considering I was holding the line. Which is not necessarily a bad thing, but it's not necessarily Blood Apps' best destiny. Right. And I actually died because they critted my leg and got the ammo there. Ugh. I mean, nothing I can do about that, right? Mm hmm. What's this? Oh. Alright, skills.
don't think I'll get this skilled up tonight fully, but it'll be close. There you go, John. Oh. Oh, thanks. And I will definitely, unless we have one or two really, really shit games, I should get the 198 match score to uh, get the 5,000 done and be halfway done that event. And then, after the stream, I got a parfait waiting for me. Granola and yogurt and fresh fruit. Mm. I get upset because the store doesn't make them all the time. But when they do, I'm like, I'll take two. Because them good. Mm. And it saves me from sweet stuff, which I'm trying to be more careful of. Well, I understand. More importantly, the only al the only caffeine I've really had is when I'm drinking alcohol or when it comes with my meal, so that's going well. I haven't had a monster in a week and change. Because monsters are fucking expensive, dog. Right? Oh. Those look good. Mo's bases. I need to get some time to play some Battletech because I'm like literally less than a year left in that uh, career mode. I'll tell you, the most fun is when they let you just dunk on fucking anything in your assault mech. <clears throat> You're like, oh, look at all the lights. And I'm like, haha, look at the artillery. Right. I'm still looking. I would, I would have loved to have found a second mortar. Because I've got a Warhammer that I can easily just pull off the LRM-10 and ammo and basically fit a mortar on. And then I could drop two mortars and a fucking uh, thumper on. And nothing says I love you quite like that. Oh, so I tell you how I took care of the... So there's the one uh, mission, the Flashpoint, where you have to face the Bounty Hunter and the Black Widow at once. No... Yeah, so Not I, run into that. I literally just went around <coughs> the sides a little bit, let them engage, then came back in. And I let I didn't even shoot at the bounty hunter or the black widow until they're the only ones left. You know, I'm like, I've got respect for this feud. I know it's a video game, but I still got respect for the feud. You guys go at it, and I'm like literally just taking down their dudes. Then finally it gets done. They both have just ravaged each other. Neither one's killed the other, and I'm like, you know what? At this point, fuck it. You two ain't killed each other. <laughs> I look over Sledge, who's my uh, guy who drives my bull truck. Fix this shit. It's like literally dropped the thumper on both of them, took them both out. Nice. You know, respect. But that one could have been fucking terrible. But literally, you, you've got to let them soft each other out and then just come to and just start murdering people. And the hard well, that's part is. That's what I've done on a, a lot of those missions. Mm -hmm. You can't. Uh, you can't salvage any mech parts because they'll have unique mechs. Oh. So partials wouldn't do any good for you. You get a lot of stuff out of it, though. So it's not like it's bad, but you're just like, oh, I don't get to salvage any mechs? Damn. But that, that particular flashpoint is probably my favorite. It was super cool. Uh, the one with the Great Death Legion I was not as huge a fan of because, like, the last mission where you're helping them get to their drop ships so they can get off the planet, mm -hmm. literally they fired twice at the first Karita Lance that, that, that showed up and not a single time at the next two Lances of Karitans that show up. I had to kill all those motherfuckers. Ugh. I did, but... Like, I'm like, oh, it's a king crab for fuck's sake. Like, oh, and an atlas for fuck's sake. Yep. It's like, damn. <clears throat> I was going to say, um, speaking of those classic mech u or merc units, like, have you looked at any of the background of where they're sitting, quote unquote, in the lore? No, I haven't, I don't, I'm not up to date on the lore by any stretch. Uh, it sounded like after the the whole Ilkhan race for Terra, like, 
none of those classic units sound like they're still alive. I mean, I'm sure they can write them back in, but they made it sound like they were all hunted down to a man. Um, I doubt they were hunted down to a man. I mean, from what I understand, there's still plenty of Merc units out there. Uh, it's oh, just, more that just those famous ones. Most like of those. Great Death. I mean, well, the Great Death actually, like, yeah, they got they were in a bad way. I think after the Steiner Civil War and all. But I understand that they came back at some point with like the son of uh, Grayson Carlisle. Yeah. So. Well, I mean, there was them and like uh, the Light Horse and a couple others. See, the clan, the clans would never hunt down and kill all of the Eridani Light Horse because they got respect because they've held up the traditions of the Star League Defense Force for fucking centuries. Because they were an SLDF unit. Mm -hmm. I love the... Man, I tell people, like, I love the background on fucking Battletech. It is fucking deep. As evidenced by the fact that, uh, fucking, uh... Tex will put out a two-hour-long video. Not granted, it had like a a forty-minute uh, uh, intro that was related, but kind of tangential, and then uh, about fifteen minutes of fun stuff at the end. So it's still over an hour on the Warhammer. Oh yeah. It's funny. Everyone's like, I didn't think it needed to be all that stuff, but. I still fucking loved it. <laughs> I didn't have a chance to, to watch it yet. I mean, two hours is a tall order. I ain't gonna lie. Well, it was because of when it came out. Yeah, Saturday. You weren't. You weren't. I was actually at my buddy Marshall's house, and I got back and had dinner. Uh, I said, uh, "Hey, do you want to watch this to uh, Banyan?" He said, "Yeah." So, I, all right, we'll watch this down here. So otherwise, I'm gonna go upstairs and watch Batman tonight, and then watch this tomorrow. Why is the slow assault in the lead? Next, I'm going after Epsilon. Who hollered that, that out? out? Jim, that just took Emma. Keep low. I don't want to see him. Uh, I don't want them to see us until we get there, Javelin. Copy. Stay to the low ground. Kappa has fallen. After Epsilon, we're going to Kappa. We're doing, but sure. Do that UAV's way out of range. Be careful on Epsilon, they might have left a guard. Yeah, I don't see one. Not close. A good start. Keep holding the resource points, warriors. They are a quarter of the way there. Do not let them push ahead. Resource point epsilon. Go. Okay, I'm ready to be in the middle. Finish out the, uh, cap on the board. You're fast enough to catch up to me. Get up, be there in a minute. Okay. 
I've got a right when coming back to uh two riflemen. Yeah, two riflemen. Raptor. Hopefully, I pulled in for you. Hotels yeah, a little I'm distracted. Take Kappa really quick and then deal with the guy in Juliet 8. New He's coming to stop acquired. us from getting Kappa. Oh, I got a light to that Kappa too. Crap. We might not be able to get this one, buddy. New target acquired. All right, you guys uh, hide in uh, Hotel Seven line. Let's let's push in a little bit, guys. Watch out! They got an army coming in. Go handle that. Target spotted. New target acquired. Army patrol, great. Keep running, gentlemen. We're halfway there. I can't take these three. Go. Get out of here. Keep the caps going. See if it's looking for data, bud. Go on. Go on, flag. So I'm push that hunchy. New target acquired. Destroyed. Corsair is right underneath this guy. It's H8. Corsair. Right underneath. Target Just put a UAV acquired. above. King Crab crossed the way, I-8. Our foes are halfway to victory. H-8. Assault coming around behind us, Hotel 7. Anybody want to help me with this course here? I don't enjoy getting pumped. I'm blocked, um, I can't make it. Just keep them busy. They've noticed that they're losing on caps. Come on, guys! Jesus Christ, you're 10 feet away. Shoot at them. Resource point Sigma is now controlled by the enemy. Course are down. down. Math. Theta is my hill, I am dying upon it. Target acquired. Target spotted. There's their be patrol. Excellent work. It didn't matter. Victory is ours. <clears throat> GG everybody, good running with you, Javelin. Good, good running with you too, this is well. everybody. <laughs> Uh oh. Say there again? Good team. Oh yeah. Uh. I'll take that equals. I, I can't. 
that's that's not the right damage. <laughs> I got no uh. kills, but I think I got three KMDDs. Yeah, three KMDDs, no kills, but I lived. Just lagged. What did the Corsair? Uh. What did our? I don't know what would just ever salt died against the Corsair. Five hundred. He was fine. Yeah. I think it was that. I mean, even though that's just quote unquote just an equals for me, I feel like that was the match that. Oh yeah, that was the good one. Yeah. Well, like I say, I mean, I don't really care. I I stop caring about what I do. I just want to have fun and feel like I did something, you know. Mm hmm. All right, so that finishes the 5,000. I'm 52% of the way through the event, so that is super good. So we're going to call it a night a little bit early. I'm going to throw some skill points in here. Oh, and I got the Crate of Sadness. Oh, Crate of Sadness time. Oh, it's common. Mine was common, too. I got the Smiley Face decal. That's a good one. <clears throat> with a clan small pulse, a case, and SRM4. All right. Well, I got three skill points to go in this thing, so next time we'll start with this. Actually, I really hate to start with it when uh, it only needs three, but, you know, well, it doesn't matter. So we'll, we'll, we'll start with it. We'll uh, probably take that point, lose that point, and see what we can do. All right, so I want to thank all of you for watching. Thanks to Cookie for popping by, Captain Mizzy for popping by, and I want to thank Mini Ninja for being here for 12 seconds, and then Legion for hanging with me for the whole time. I will catch you guys on Wednesday for the uh, Clan Salvage Box unboxing, and uh, until then, have a good one. We're out. <laughs>